Hi everyone. Today I want to talk about a Tai Chi inspired warm up. In many Tai Chi classes, you'll find a classic warm up exercise, which is just a held posture, no movement at all. <clears throat> One of the classic postures of this kind is standing on one foot. I'm standing on my right, for instance, and putting my left foot out with the knee bent and only toe touching the ground. Holding the arms out front with suspended elbows and fingers, feeling an energy between each other, face pulling towards each other, as it were. And a teacher might ask you to hold this posture for 10 minutes, 20 minutes, however masochistic they're feeling that day. And after a while, you'll really start to notice anywhere in your body that you're holding tension. You might notice that you're holding some tension in the foot you're standing on. You might feel a shoulder raised. You might notice that you're holding your breath. After a few minutes, all these things start to rear their heads and teach you how to release them because you can't keep holding in a way that's tense. It won't sustain. So the analogous warm-up exercise to this in the violin is long tones. My teacher, Joseph Gingold, had this, he called it a game, of holding, playing one bow for six minutes. That's very much analogous. However, at that speed, you really can't make a sound at all. And I prefer to use slightly faster bows, but aim for a real sound. So I reckon a good length of time to aim for at first is a half a minute, building up towards one minute. So it's a similar idea. You set yourself up. You feel whether your body is balanced. Do I have even weight on my feet? How are my knees? Are they locked or are they released? My hips? Is my breathing going fluidly through my whole torso? How are my shoulders? How are my elbows, wrists? And then begin from the tip because it's usually a more relaxed place. And take a nice breath and start to go. And as you do your up bow, you might run into some bubbly moments where you realize that maybe the shoulder's a little tight or you can hold the thumb more relaxed. Or possibly you stop breathing. You carry on. And when you get to the heel, this is a good time to do an actual Tai Chi-like holding exercise where you hold the posture of the bow being just above the string for or five minutes, 10 minutes, whatever you want. And just have a little visit through, the, through your body. How's your breathing? How are your knees, hips, shoulders, arms, fingers? And then when you've done that for a while, then you do a long bow on the down bow. So I reckon a good starting place is to aim for half a minute per bow and building up to a minute. Have fun. Let me know how you go.